What's up, everybody? So we have uh, four new codes for Soul Leveling Arise. I'll put them uh, on the first comment. As you can see, I got 10 Webon draw tickets. And I wasn't even at the bidding. I was like 15 or 16 uh, on the bidding count. And I got the best two Webons in the game. This is probably the first time I get crazy lucky with, uh, with this. Now we still have one more, so let's give it a try. I'll show you what else we got from um, from um, the codes that I just showed you guys. So here are the codes: ten summon tickets, mana, uh, mana bar extract, and rune stone will give you guarantee uh, epic uh, rune. Ten boxes, those. Now they nerf the rewards, but they're still useful at some point. And another thousand is in stone, which always good. Let me actually open the boxes and show you guys. I'm just open all of them together. I don't like wasting time like that. And uh, yeah, that's what we got. Let's, uh, my apologies. Let's go to Fusion and Fuse. We could get something decent out of all of this. No. I don't think that's gonna happen today. Oh, nothing here. Really? Mm hmm? Mm. Yes. This is the most lucky recording ever. Let's go! So after I make you excited for the next update, and hopefully you get lucky also in uh, the codes, let me show you a quick recap to the live stream and what kind of adjustment we're going to get during this live stream. Actually, uh, the voice. So uh, the the biggest uh, adjustment that we're going to get is uh, the leveling up reward. So once we get Sanjin Wu to level ninety, we will be able to get total of seventy Weibon ticket and hundred and ten custom draw ticket, which is really really massive. Uh, if you're someone like me who's uh, Already level uh, 90 on the game. Uh, did I say 50 early? 90, I mean. If you're someone like me who's already at level 90 and already got every single reward in the game, you will be able to get all those new rewards directly after the update, which really big reward. Now, uh, it could be sent through email or you just collect it manually through just clicking on uh, the uh, reward itself uh, from here. But overall, this is really, really massive. A big reward we're going to get directly after that death. I believe most of you, even if you are not level 90, probably are above 80. I mean, as I said, most of you. So you will be able to get a good amount of those uh, tickets. Now let's talk about another uh, adjustment we, they're going to make after the update, which change the keys cap. Now you won't be able to accumulate the keys for the anchor mission and uh, the chaos and the instance dungeon. Uh, so uh, now we have, like before the update, we have to do all those instances or dungeons or whatever every single day. If you didn't finish them in the same day, the keys will be reset within the next day and you're gonna lose the keys that you been previously owning. Now you will be able to accumulate the, key, the, the those keys. I'm not sure exactly for how much you will be able to accumulate. Like, is it for two days? Let's say 12 keys, 18 keys. 
Um, there is no much details about this, but I believe we're going to get uh, news about this very, very uh, soon. And uh, another thing will be some uh, adjustment to the combat power for the Baron Norma mode. Vulcans, uh, Vulcan will get massive uh, nerf, I believe. Now this is about the uh, championship for the uh, solo leveling uh, rise. And there is a, here is the, the biggest thing that I want to talk about it. The, this is one of the cuts that I bought and uh, in the comment section, everyone can see it. Uh, there is this new boss that will be introduced to the game. Actually, lower their voice. I don't think any one of you guys understand what's going on. So um, this uh, boss looks actually really, really cool. And um, yeah, I will be really, really excited to uh, try him out. We are going to get a new shadow. So uh, as you can see here, now uh, this is a translation to the transcription. Fly Dragon effect, increase the ultimate damage. Okay, so this is really cool. The, the Shadow Authority will increase the ultimate uh, damage, which really, really cool. Now this is, will be really massive for someone like Charlotte. Charlotte rely a lot on her ultimate with, you know, her crazy ultimate uh, uh, recovery and cooldown with this uh, shadow authority that will be massive power boost to uh, Charlotte now of course we're gonna try this out after the update so make sure to subscribe to the channel to see my testing and everything about that now there will be a new power system but i don't want to talk too much about this because it really know too much about this now those are probably the monarchs in the game we only got baron so far but uh, eventually we're going to get every sorry we're going to get every single one of them about the gems, and this is something I don't like, to be honest, because I don't even have the previous max tier uh, of the gems. Now they're going to add a new tier of gems. So this is not something that every free-to-play player will like. I mean, at least that's my opinion. I don't think any free-to-play -to player will like this uh, <laughs> adjustment to the game. Now, um, this about the Baron, no, uh, sorry, hard mode. So the first thousand players that will finish the uh, Baron will get this uh, custom. And first 3000 will get this one, I believe, hopefully I'm not mistaken. And uh, yeah, they're going to receive an additional rewards, Mark of Time 30 and the like lower tier 30 20 custom draw tickets and as you see all the rewards you can see in front of you guys and the biggest uh, uh, this are this is a showcase to uh, some events that we're going to get and this is isla the new hunter that we're going to get after the update we're going also to get a custom for uh, men and uh, a new bumpkin uh, event weapon. I have to say, the skin looks really, really cool for uh, men. And this is probably the first, exclude uh, Sanji Wu. This is uh, the first male skin, I believe, in the game. Um, some of you will mention the one from the secret library for uh, someone like Goganhi, but that's not actually skin, it's just changing the color of his custom. So I'm not actually counting that as a custom. So this is probably the first real custom for any male character we be getting in the game. Now this is uh, probably a new event we're going to get. 
and uh, they're going to send some artifacts. Probably it's, it's going to be the same as one of the artifacts that we'll pretty have on, on the game. Same as what they did before in the 60 day uh, anniversary, I believe, or 90 day anniversary, 100 day maybe. I forgot to be honest. But um, yeah, they give us uh, two artifacts. One of them was the expert and the other one was actually the toughness set. Now, we're going to get uh, a massive event. We're going to get, other than the, what I previously mentioned, this is something totally different. We're going to get 50 weapon uh, draw tickets, which will make a lot of draw tickets available for us during this update. And this will help, uh, help everyone to boost, get massive boost to their power. Also, um, by the way, I think they are talking uh, or throw talk to other games like uh, Genshin Impact and uh, those games that giving crappy rewards to their community. What we're going to get here, and this is probably the biggest reward we're going to get during this uh, update, we're going to get this is our hunter from our choice. Uh, I believe the hunters that we could choose from is Charlotte, Harper, and Mary. And listen to what they are saying. Look, first time this is with BD. A conventional, right, for the 0.5 week will give you Choice of Hunter will give you SSR. You will be choosing between Dark Attribute and Wind Attribute Hunter. But if you other games, neighbors, <laughs> this is why I want this. Is... Let me show you. So this is something they actually talking about other games. If you look at other games in uh, neighborhood, which they talking about the other gacha games, you will see that was released long time ago. There are times when have to put in few characters. So what they are talking about it here, they uh, in my in my opinion, they are talking about something like Genshin Impact after like three years or four years. They give us the anniversary reward, which choosing five star uh, character from like the very, very old characters, which useless characters in, in, in the uh, like current meta on, on the game. They give them like Diluc, uh, Jean. I'm not like saying they are too, too crabby, but compared to the new units, they are absolutely useless. So what they are saying here, we're giving you a very valuable hunters. And uh, to be honest, those are the best hunters right now for the hardest content in the game which the uh baron uh, normal mode we're going to get the hard mode so even in the hard mode those are going to be especially mary and charlotte the best wind hunter and the best dark hunter in the game and a very very good breaker i would say maybe the second best breaker in the game next to uh gogani gogani is probably the best right now and yeah, this is a very, very solid uh, reward. And we're going to get, beside all of that, 50 uh, weapon draw ticket. That's really, really massive. And uh, I really like it. And uh, this is the best event we ever got in the game. If you are someone unlucky, just like me, guys, this is the best event in the game. And I'll make... Uh, specific video about this uh, kind of uh, event so you don't waste your uh, tickets on this event because it's really really valuable and it, it will make a massive difference in your account i'll tell you the best stats what you should do what you shouldn't do which pieces you should pick and uh, yeah this is the most event um, i've been excited to be part of it 
maybe maybe we're not getting all the all kind of artifacts i'm uh, not sure about that but be, we will uh, like see all that uh, very soon so this is like quick recap i know it's not really that quick but i was really really excited about a lot of the news that we're going to get during the next update including new ssr hunter a lot like this is probably the highest amount of uh, draw tickets that we're going to get in one single update i mean like i'm getting over 200 tickets almost uh when uh, the update launch so this is something i'm really very very excited to as a free-to-play player and uh, the some event like as i said the artifact crafting event is probably the best uh, events in the game we have ever had in uh, in the game so thanks very much for watching make sure guys to uh like the video, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, I've uh, just joined the Netmarble supporter uh, program. As you can see here, I'm, uh, I'm officially content creator for Solo Leveling Arise and part of their community. I have uh, some codes to give away to my community, so make sure to support me so I can send you directly those codes. I have like 596 right now and uh, I'm going to do all the missions for the future uh, codes uh, so if like by supporting me I will send you every single code available uh, directly guys and as I said the codes during the live stream will be in uh, the uh, first comment of uh, this video so make sure to share me the rewards that you got from uh, summoning using those God's rewards. Thanks very much for watching. Hopefully, see you soon.